something that's important to understand is if you are getting out of a relationship where the person was fine, but the attraction just wasn't there, or the sexual relationship wasn't there, you're way more susceptible to fall for a narcissist. And here's why. The thing that narcissists are experts at is a superficial charm and a projection like they are more successful, more interesting than they actually are. And if you're going into dating like, eh, I don't feel that desirable, I don't really know what I bring to the table, a narcissist is gonna be able to pick up on that from a mile away and take advantage of it. These people will flatter you, these people will give you compliments, and if you automatically fall in love with them just because they told you that you were pretty or hot, then they are going to know that that is what they can use to manipulate you. They can give you some words of affirmation and they can infiltrate your psyche. So don't fall for the superficial, shallow, surface level compliments that the narcissist is trying to give you because you feel down about your last relationship or you haven't been with somebody for a while. You need to be going into dating knowing exactly who you are, what you bring to the table, and why you are worthy of love just the way that you are. This is the intangible things. Looks don't matter when you're journaling about this. It matters that you're a good listener, that you're loyal, that you're a great friend, etc. You are building up your self-confidence and your self-worth so that you don't fall for the love scam. So that if a narcissist tries to date you and they're like, you're so fun, you're so exciting, you got it all together, you're like, yeah, I know. You want to go in with the perspective that compliments are nice, being told that you look good or that you're sexually appealing or whatever it is, is nice, but it's not gonna make you change your plans with your friends. It's not gonna make you move into their house when you've known them for a month, right? Like you gotta be realistic about how much you know this person and if you can trust them. My book on Amazon, Navigating Narcissists, is now available as an audiobook. The link to that is in my bio.